Hey everybody, it's Admiral Polo here today, and first off, I do apologize, I have a, a sore throat, well it's not really sore, I just kind of like lost my voice, so I do sound a bit retarded, actually, I don't know what I sound like, because I haven't really listened to it, because it wasn't that bad yesterday, but it got really bad this morning, but um, yeah, anyway, um, a lot of you guys have been asking me questions about bonus XP weekend, so I figured I might as well just make a video, because I don't really have enough clips to make a proper road for PVM Pro, it'd be like 7 minutes long, and I've only accomplished one major thing since the last episode, I think. Um, so anyway, here's some of the tips that I can give you. First off, the weekend is March 16th, um, because a lot of you don't read the behind the scenes, I guess. Um, it starts March 16th. The multiplier slowly trickles down from 2.7x to 1.1x over 8 hours, and it will stay at 1.1x for the remainder of the weekend. Um, skills to not train over bonus XP weekend, don't train prayer because it does not work with bonus XP weekend, um, as it does not stack with a gilded altar. Um, don't train, uh, summoning until you're at 1.1x, unless you literally have 99 and everything besides summoning. Um, because summoning is 1.1x, uh, the entire weekend. Although, once you get down to the 1.1x multiplier, it wouldn't be a bad idea to do some summoning, because you literally have the entire weekend once you get down to that 1.1x multiplier. Um, I know a lot of people have said this, but if you're doing farming, plant the best trees and herbs and stuff that you possibly can, and log out at the farming spots, be right before the update or, like, the day before, so that everything's grown, so you can log in and, um, quickly get that 2.7, uh, XXP on farming, um, that's also really useful. I probably won't be doing that, because, let's, uh, let's be honest, I don't care about far uh, farming right now. The highest I need to get it, I think, is 65, so I can do well Gothic Sleeps for my Road to PVM Pro series. But, um, some skills that I'd recommend doing, Herbalore, very expensive. Either do really slow skills like runecrafting, agility, or do really expensive skills like smithing, crafting, Herblore. Um, and I'm not entirely sure on this, but I don't think you get double dungeoneering tokens. Correct me if I'm wrong, but if I'm right, uh, I wouldn't do dungeoneering either because you may get double XP, but if you don't get double tokens, you're just going to have to do the dungeoneering anyway. Um, if you're going to be doing stuff like Herblor and you have some leftover Dungeoneering tokens, it wouldn't be a bad idea <clears throat> to um, go get a Scroll of Cleansing, I think it's called, from Dungeoneering, because it saves secondaries. Also, if you don't care about skilling, you still have an opportunity to buy supplies and profit. I bought 20,000 um, potions to make for Herblor, and if I were to sell them, I would make 26 mil. Since my bank video yesterday, I've made 4 mil off those, although I'm keeping them to use, but, um... Yeah, you can still buy supplies like, um, mahogany planks will probably rise, oak planks, herblore supplies, um... <clears throat> dehyde, uh, leather, like, blue, red, uh, black, and green because of crafting. Adamant bars are probably skyrocketing. So if you want to do something right now, I wouldn't... Wouldn't be a bad idea to go to Avancies or whatever you call them, the Armadale Kill Count, because um, if Adamant Bars are rising, the price for those will, well, obviously, the money per hour there will be much higher, and I think it's like 30k range XP an hour, which isn't horrible, I wouldn't train range there, but, um, let's see, what other skills would I, s I'm trying to think of anything else here, let me look at uh, Zafri and see if I've noticed something that I didn't mention, um, I'm just looking through here, seeing if I can think of something to tell you guys, well, not think, but see something, um, blah, 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 um, mm. yeah, I wouldn't do skills like fletching, because fletching, you can already get over, well, I think dragon darts is like a mil XP an hour, but more reasonably is broad arrows, but that's still really expensive. Also, if you're going to be doing a skill like Hunter, or, off, oh, not Fishing, let's just go with Hunter. If you have to compete over spots, um, a wise idea would be to, um, switch worlds and go, or switch servers and go into a different language, um, so that there's not as much people, but you do have to get there really early, because I'm assuming those worlds will fill up really fast. Um, 
I do have a guide on how to switch the languages, if you have no idea what I'm talking about. Um, I'll link it in the description. My god, my voice is just getting worse and worse. I should have had, like, some Dr. Pepper or something to drink. Um, <coughs> but, um, it was initially used to switch, um, worlds to get rid of bots, but it's the same concept. Just ignore what I say about bots. Um, let's see what else here. Go to a different page. Everything, um... You don't do easy skills like cooking or AFKable skills. I'm not saying don't, I'm just saying I wouldn't. If you want to, I'm not saying don't do it. I'm saying not to do things like prayer because it doesn't work. Um, yeah, I wouldn't recommend training combat either because for the same reason of Hunter. And bonus XP weekend does not stack with Skull Boots, doesn't stack with Haiti Paws, doesn't. I don't think it stacks with Brawlers, not sure, but I highly doubt it. Um, assists don't work on it, um, you don't get double XP from effigies or lamps or anything like that, and you don't get XP from, you don't get double XP from, like, penguins and circus and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that's really all I have to say, and, um, hopefully I will be able to, um, talk soon so that I can actually make a road to BVM Pro, because I'm probably gonna sound like shit. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for watching, please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.